Hello, and welcome. I'm Zyander, and here we are once again playing Dark Souls 2. And there's an item over here. Uh, destroy that. Pick up our item. Soul of a Lost Undead and a torch. Very good. Interesting gravestone. And we'll have a look, see what's out here. A fog door. Hmm. Do I trust the doors of fog? Screw it. Uh huh. I see. Okay, I am going to have to use the lock-on, I think. Which is unsurprising. Uh, I'm not sure how I feel about the dual wield. about that. I just may end up putting a shield on. A dagger. Uh... Is that my... I don't know. The thing about this is it scales better with decks, but the damage it's showing. What is. Your letters down there don't make any sense to me. I'm not using an Xbox controller. I don't know what those mean. Is there anything up here besides that? Oh, another door. Okay. Do 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 do. do. And you're dead. Deal with it. Life gem. I think that's used for healing, but I'm not sure. You, you, give it, Moose. Yes, you! Give us Silky! Oh, God. Go. Hold down the sprint key. Where am I now? So that is where I went. There's an item there. Now I went up, but I'm wondering if there's perhaps an additional way I could go. I'm not really seeing one, but I didn't look as hard as I could have either. So, I want to see if I can't find this ledge containing that item. This one, right down here. Oh, I missed! You died. Yes, thank you. I hadn't noticed. 
damn game. Uh, okay. So, there was an important thing that was in the keybinds that I didn't pay attention to, which would have been really helpful in this situation to have paid attention to it. Which is the, uh, the walk key. sure if he still hit me. Play Dougally. So I'm going to try walking off the ledge this time. You know, there was a ladder. I could have just gone up the ladder. I kicked it down. back. There we go. That's better. Soul of a nameless soldier. And there's the ladder I kicked down. Oh, hey, I'm hollow now. That looks funky. So, I could keep going that way, or I could explore more fog. Into the mist. So I suppose, see what the, well, uh, oops, that is not how you jump. I have made a mistake, and I may sound fight slightly farther away now, because I have relaxed back in my chair. Speaking of sounding farther away and microphone related things. I was considering getting a microphone, but any money I'd consider spending on a microphone kind of went into getting this game. That, and I couldn't find one for a decent price that wasn't constantly listed as being potentially... Come on now. Uh, let me guess. I probably have to be sprinting and then press the key. Uh, death by trying to understand keybinds. We're going to make this game more PC friendly. Oh, by the way, everything's going to be listed in Xbox controls, and we're going to choose funky keybinds for your actual things. I, I hate to say it, but your lack of PC gaming is showing. Uh, what can you expect from somebody who makes console games? Okay, you know what? Let's test it here. So, I do in fact have to be sprinting. Amber Herb times two. Ooh. Oh, hey, I see you there. So now, the grand question is, is where does this take us?
There's a fog door, and I can drop attack this fool. Although the drop attack didn't go quite as well as I would have liked. Is there anything else done? There's a door there, and a fog door here. Okay, so where are we at now? That's the ladder we kicked down. And this just seems to look out from here. So I could jump down, or I could go back and see if I can't go through that door. Correct red eye orb. I think this used for invasions. So I guess now I will jump down and head through here. Looks like death for sure. Oh, I see. Go away. So I can jump down there where there's a guy waiting. Uh, can I possibly roll over to him and drop attack him? No. Ow. Ladder up there. Another fog door. Okay, so... Trying to attack that guy was a very large mistake. mistake that's not going to mean a whole hell of a lot. Hey, you. You're dead. Is there no safer way down here? It doesn't look like it. Ow. So, it slowly regenerates health. Whoops. No, that's not what I meant to do. No. Bloodstain. Shoot again, please. Thank you. Wrong button. Gonna get shot in the back, I'm sure. We missed. Okay. Hit him. Thank you. So, there's the ladder. That seems to end up just on the other side of this. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, the combat feels a bit odd. I think I'm better off with a shield. I do have these options, more or less. The only one I really have the sets to wear is this. And this is one of the pre-order items, as far as I know. And as soon as I find a different shield, I'll probably replace it. That animation did not seem normal. I want to try something. If I were to put that there and 
that there. Now I can hold right click to block. Okay. Better. Uh. So I guess there's not much for it other than to head up through here. What? Messages? Praise the sun. Good luck. Be wary of death. Hope ahead, therefore, good luck. Hurrah for comfort, but death ahead. Ah, uh, people. Yeah. Oh, oh god. Oh, oh, it's bright. It's bright. It's very bright. Very bright. Much bright. Don't like bright. Bright is very bright. Soul. Divine blessing. Is that a miracle? I think that might be a miracle. No? Uh, well, sort of. Sort of a miracle. There's a bonfire. I will take that. I think what we're gonna do is we're going to have a quick look around this area and then I think I'll call it good for then. For you. You're undead, aren't you? Yes. You have that distinct scent, the smell of irreversible fate. What are you saying I stink? This is Majula. It is a kind of settlement. A place where life is almost normal. And in Drang Lake these days, there are very few places like that. I see. I am Solden. And like you, I lost everything. And now I'm here. Are you sure you're here? You probably heard that it was possible to break the curse here. Well... That's not true at all. Yeah, that's what they There's said in the nothing last here for you, me, or anybody. Do you know much about souls? I'm pretty sure they're used for leveling. Even up. I'm not certain, but I'm told that the soul is the essence of life itself. Oh, give or take. Anything living, sentient or no, supposedly has one. What we call the curse is traceable to the soul. Do you see what that means? Souls are a curse? To be alive. To walk this earth. That's the real curse, right there. So more or less, yes. To have a soul we is a curse. We undead will never die. And that's quite a predicament, really. There are four beings in this land with giant souls. And wherever you go from here, you'll sooner or later come up against them. Each has a powerful soul and a terrible curse. Oh? Curse? If that frightens you, then you ought to just give up right now. Like I have. <laughs> Quitter. Do Anything you ever say? cry out for help? Yeah. This guy the has journey so many of an undead is long and treacherous. You'll face invaders from other worlds at every turn. If you need help, why not proclaim faith in the Blue Sentinels? When you face danger, the Blue Sentinels will come to your aid. Who are the Blue Sentinels? Protection is yours, if you wish. You need only accept their kind embrace. Eh, uh, sure. I don't know what it is, but I'll join you. 
Blue seal. Entered that is a wise decision. People are weak, but the blue sentinels watch over us in their benevolence. Let the sentinels cradle you in their embrace. I should really look and see what that item does here in a second. Okay. Uh... What? No. Stay here. Enemies react to invaders from other worlds. What? Interesting. Invade other worlds, as I thought. Banish phantoms, return to your world. Uh, restores the link to other worlds. Lose souls and return to last bonfire used. So what was that thing he gave me then? Covenant ring for apostles of blue. Uh... Can I... Surely one of these nine keys... Oh. Increases HP slightly... The blue is no when a pulse blue invaded by dark spirits, they can receive assistance from masters of other worlds. Hell, that sounds convenient. And it is a ring that grants me a small amount of HP, so I shall wear that. Anything else to say? Do you feel lonely here? It suits me just fine. As I have nothing left, anyway. It will grow on you, this place. Give it some time. Oh. Welcome, Gesture. Uh... Let's see. May you find peace on your journey. Righty-ho. Where's my welcome gesture? Okay. Touch blood stain. You can watch how somebody managed to kill themselves. Uh, I'm beginning to think that he attacked this guy. Why would you do that? It seems pointless and irrelevant. Locked. So the name of the soldier and three life gems. Cool. So I don't quite want to leave this place just yet. Oh. Hmm. That's good. Let's try the boxes. A life gem. Very good. Uh, that looks like it probably moves on to the next area. That moves on to an area as well, although... There's enough bloodstains there that it makes me think the other A, people failed horribly. Are you a merchant? Uh, oh. oh hello there. Oh? W welcome to my uh, shop. I'm Morlin. And, uh, well, I sell armor. I see. Oh, sorry, I... Please do have a look at my wares. You're a very I strange I could really person. use the business. If you'd be so kind. Okay, let's have a look see what you've got. Expensive, expensive, expensive things. So a silver kite shield. Uh, what is that? 90% reduction on physical damage? Is that what that is over there? But it costs 1500 Then he's got armor. Interesting concepts. Uh... Well, I... I, well, I do hope I see you again. That... That completely reminded me of the fact of there's the whole... Weight... 
factor in this. Uh, what was that down there? 47 out of 50? I'm not quite sure how things quite whoops, work out in this. Because the interface is slightly different. Ooh, Titanite Shard. I believe that's used for upgrading, if it's like the previous one, which I don't see why it wouldn't be. Oh. Ah! Deal with it. I'm going to assume this door is locked. Door's locked, but of course. Oh god. Watch out for the diseased pigs. Apparently they're the deadliest thing ever. Yeah. I'm not sure how I feel about these. Having difficulties actually swinging at them because they're so short. I think that I don't really like the short sword. So let's actually replace said short sword with the. Uh, sorry, straight sword. The curved sword. Since it's got a downward swing. It might just work just a little bit better. Although I'm going to get my souls and have a look-see at the bonfire. See about upgrading. So I'm curious. And then I'm going to call this good, which I expected to do probably 5-10 minutes ago. Uh... How does one upgrade? How does one level up? How does level? Does not level? Level is 12 apparently. I have 990 and I'm confused. Yeah, I am slip. I'm slightly confused how I'm supposed to actually level up. Okay, so help. Overall attributes consume souls to level up. This wasn't lit up before. Oh, I probably... What? Quite a number of souls to level up, Riesling levels and attribute. Yes, but how do I actually level up? I feel like I've missed something important. Uh, now that I'm thinking about it, maybe I'm not supposed to be able to level up yet? And that's my given problem. Way of blue. Swordsman. No spells. Uh, 
Okay. Don't want to do that. And apparently I can, yeah. But uh, I'm going to call this good. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.